The McMahon family intending to sell their own company, sell the WWE. You want to talk about changing the course of history. Capital founder Emmanuel Lemelson, who manages one of the biggest hedge funds in the world, recently stated that he believes, firmly believes, the McMahon family intends to sell the WWE. Lemelson also called WWE clearly an acquisition target and said that while he doesn't expect WWE to have great numbers when they announce the WWE Network subscriber count on Thursday during their third quarter conference call, he also doesn't expect the share prices to fall as the McMahons will protect shares to keep the sale price up. He also spoke about his belief that WWE has poor fiscal management but claimed they have a strong creative management. But he is still under the impression that the McMahon family are going to sell the WWE. Now, I'll tell you what, ladies and gentlemen, this will have major ramifications on the history of the WWE, where it goes, uh, the booking, the management, the priorities. Um, we could be looking at a whole different dynamic. The WWE could change for the better, but it could also change for the worse. And I'm talking TNA worse. I'm talking to that. Well, then again, I don't know about that. I mean... You know, I'm not into all this money financial thing and how to grow and expand and all this other stuff, all the business aspects of it. I'm not really one of those people in it, but if you take the McMahon family out of it, maybe the Levesque's, well, you know, Triple H is married with Stephanie, so it's still clearly McMahon business. You would think it would always be in the family, though, but this would be crucial. I mean, I never thought I'd hear, I never thought I'd see the day that the McMahon family would want out of the business that they've had enough. Now, once again, this isn't confirmed, but there's a strong belief that this is what's going to happen. Now, you got to wonder what would happen to the WWE. What would it look like? All right. What would happen of Monday Night Raw? What about the pay-per-views? What about the WWE Network? What about everything that the McMahon family has done? I mean, let's look at it. Let's be realistic here. As much as you want to criticize and talk, talk down Vince McMahon, if it weren't for Vince McMahon, the WWE wouldn't be half of what it is today. If it weren't for Vince McMahon and Hulk Hogan. Hell, we can go all the way back to Bob Backlund. This definitely throws a swerve in the WWE. What do you think about it? Do you think it's a good thing, a bad thing? Do you think it's actually going to happen? Your comments, your opinions, subscribe.